Hello and welcome to Teresa's Crafts. I'm Teresa, I'm nine years old and right now I'm in my uncle's house in Turkey. Though I live in London. So this is my first video on YouTube and I'm so excited to be posting with you. So today we're going to be making a rose baby, but before we do that, I'd like to show you some of my earlier things. This is a little rabbit called Mary, which I made for a school project about a book called Edward Tulane. This is a ballerina. And this is an elephant. Okay, so I'd like to show you the clay and tools that you need. Over here we have Peach Female Professional do for Dollar Art, but you can use whatever brand you need. Here we have White Female Soft, Black Female Soft, Female Brown Female Professional, and Red Female Soft. Again, you can use whatever brand you want or you need whatever fits you best. So our tools are going to be a brush with fine bristles, a cocktail stick, two dotting tools, different sizes, and this stick which I like to use to put heads of dolls on. And also a blade, and this really nice tool which you can use for really anything. So, let's begin. First you need to take this ball and make a line against it. Like that. Then, with this, you need to smooth it down. Like that. and then you can use your finger. Then, I'm going to take this just to make some dots where the ears will be placed. And I can smooth it all out in both directions. Then, I can stick the stick in as I begin. I'm going to make a very nice shape for the head, just making the neck. And then I'm going to sculpt the front of the head, the cheeks, which would go there, just like that. So then we'll need this tool. And we're going to make marks here, and here. And you just want to make like that, and like that. So you know what the eye holes will be. I'm going to take some other pieces of clay and I'm going to knead it all up and then I'm going to make a nice small ball of around this much and I'm going to flatten it slightly and just put it in there. Then I'm going to take this cocktail stick and just smooth it all upwards. And with this one, just make it nice and smooth. So you'd probably come out with something like this and then you take it from the edge and blend it all together. Like that. I'm going to do the other eye socket. So you, again, you roll it into a ball, you flatten a bit, you press, you insert it in, and I use my finger to just smooth it all out. Okay, then you can just make it as smooth as possible all around the eyes and then you want to move the eyes and face slightly closer together like that 
Okay. Now, what you want to do is just take a nice small regular ball of clay and you roll it like that and you just put it on like that with this tool you roll up okay then we need to just smooth the forehead down a bit and if you look up very carefully at the cheeks you can see that I'm slightly going in to make the mouth slightly closer. Now, I'm going to take my cocktail stick and again, with this, I'm going to go under the nose, smooth it out and make two little holes. Now let's make the mouth. So with that, you'd probably want to begin with this tool, this one, and you just make a small dot slightly in. You take this and you go in and you press it out. You go in and you press it out. Now, then you wanna slightly, it's just starting to get there. And now you can start getting some bigger tools to really shape it. You can do a little tiny little mouth. And then little, just like, the mouth is probably just slightly bigger than the nose. So you can just do some little dots to make it look really nice and cute. And then do that. So now we want to really make the lips come out like that. We're going to take this and we're going to really smooth it all out. Everything like that. I'm going to take this and just really do a really small little dot and make it go out like smiling. And then we're going to begin on working on the really small details. With a cocktail stick, we're going to go under the eye and just straight a small line. And with that, we add another small line for the bottom eyelid, because when you close your eyes, you cut the top one and the small one. And just a really small, cute little one there for the finish. And another one there. Now, we're going to take this and just really close in the mouth a bit from here and make it come out from there. So can you see that it looks so happy just smiling as much as it can? Now I'm going to take my brush and I'm going to just give a nice smooth layer all around the face. And then I'm going to sculpt a chin for her. And then we're going to close her eyes so it looks like she's really having a nice dream about little cupcakes or unicorns or whatever you like. Okay, now we're going to take the blade and cut under the eye like that. Okay, once you've cut underneath the eye, we're going to really just smoothly make a little line underneath that too. Okay, now, we need to give her a little chin. Okay. Then, we've got the, to make the ears, so we get a bit of clay, we roll it up like that, we flatten it, put it on, then this, we smooth it in into the head. 
and we're going to take out the ears a bit like that and we do the same with the other side Okay, now let's quickly just slide the head off. I'm going to use some of my tools because I think she's trying to stay on there. And just take it off and put it to the side for later. We again are going to take our clay. And we're going to make the body. How we're going to do this is we're just going to roll it all up in a ball. And then we're going to take our finger and we're just going to smooth it all down. And we're going to take the end and just make it really slim to get into the hole that we made for the head. And we're going to very gently, maybe I could make this a bit thinner, just insert it in and see where it needs to be cut to make it shorter. So once we've got the body, we're going to just gently use our finger to just give it a nice little shape. And we're going to tilt the head slightly. Okay. Now, to make the arms, you want to make two, like, sausage rolls. Like this. And then you smooth it all out and make it nice and thin. To make the hands, we're going to make a circle, press it down, take fingers, and we roll out a long sausage, like this. And with that, we just make tiny little fingers, which we're going to stick on here. And we make them close around the hand and smooth it in like this.